Hey, my beautiful people, what's up? I'm going to be showing you guys how to make this super cute Barbie ponytail. So if you like what you see, keep on watching because we're just going to jump right into it because it's kind of a lengthy tutorial, but not really. So just keep on watching. <laughs> Had you for a summer, then I broke you off. I say, Boy, shawty, who ain't penny wise? Like Holly. Hey, beautiful ladies. I just wanted to stop in the middle of this video real quick and just say that thank you, Cupsheet, for giving me the opportunity to present to you these super, very cute, affordable swimwear. And I want to say it's super, super cute because summer is right around the corner. And if you guys don't know, now you know, I am expecting another baby. These bathing suits are very, very cute. It's giving very much sexy, very much mama vibes. And, you know, I want to go on the beach and I want to feel cute. Even though I have my belly, I want to feel cute when I go to the beach. These bathing suits are definitely giving that. I worked with Cupshe before and let me just tell you the quality the quality of cup she has gotten so much better we're just gonna first start off by saying not only do they sell the bikinis they sell loungewear dresses sports bras leggings I just, I just wore the leggings earlier and i really felt like a bad bitch but you know my coochie a little too fat for that so i had to take them off <laughs> We're going to be talking about the bathing suits. The bathing suits are very, very much flattering. Like I said, I do have a belly right now. I am currently seven months pregnant and I have a belly right now. But when I put these bathing suits on, you can almost, you, you can't even tell I'm pregnant unless I go to the side. And like, I feel very comfortable while wearing these. I love how they look on my body. It literally shapes my body. It shapes my belly. But like I said, you can't even tell that I'm pregnant unless I turn to the side. And I love that. It's very hard trying to find maternity clothing, especially when you're going to the beach. I know that me and my boyfriend may go to jamaica soon for um a wedding i'm just excited because now i have some super cute sexy outfits and bathing suits to wear on that wedding you know what i'm saying so we're just gonna get into a couple of the changes that they do have um that they made you know over the years so the cup size i'm gonna insert me wearing two of the of my favorite bathing suits this cup size is very cute and it's very much given like i don't I, I got mom tits and it's not giving mom tits at all the way that the cup size is it is like it literally it just like shapes me very nicely you know it's not giving push up and none of that but it just shapes like my tits like very cute and it's very easy to remove the other ones are a little hard to remove but these ones all you gotta do is take it out but honestly i wouldn't take it out because if you got weird look at titties or whatever you want to call it like those really do shape them and make them look very very much nice so yeah the straps are very much affordable and like i said they do have better quality fabrics um very much better much patterns and they have certain styles for every type of woman so i definitely would go on there and you know check it out because they look they're so cute majority of their items are under 25 dollars they are very very affordable um so if you just want something quick and easy you know you don't want no target looking stuff definitely go to cup she because they got everything from cover-ups to the bikini bottoms to the one piece to the two piece like they got everything like and it's just so cute like if you want to go to the beach and look cute cup she is giving you you know what, what they post to gave they even have like trendy items i'm not really into like the whole trendy type of things but i like neutrals and i really did a good job picking these stuff out neutrals is super cute super my vibe and i'm just loving the whole neutral look and i'm super excited to wear these to the beach because i don't i probably won't go to the beach but if i don't go to the beach i'm gonna wear it i'm gonna act like i'm at the beach okay so if you decide to go on cup she and order a couple items you might get carried away so i was able to get you guys a coupon code we're gonna go ahead and do nay 15 for 50 percent off for 65 dollars and up so if you order two four six three pairs of whatever you will have enough because they range from whatever to 25 so you'll have you know a nice little discount you know here and there so we're just gonna um stop this right there but you don't need to check back in my life i'm probably good i can't think though i still need advice i need a cure no, I need I don't wanna be complacent since I graduated. Spent the whole summer on this work that wouldn't pay me. Like how I'm supposed to come up when they keep me stuck in JV. Push the escape, don't control whether you blame me. I have to let it go. A couple people that I have to let them know. Can't keep looking over my friends covering foes. 
my hair is really fine so i'm really just gonna blow dry it and flat iron it out but if you have thicker hair it'll be easier if you flat iron it so then when you put it up in your ponytail all you gotta do is bump your ends but really the main thing right now is just smoothing the hair out to pull it up into your ponytail Poutine dish with a filter fish. Yellow tail sip and a soul and dip. Crab ass niggas get a thirdly clip. Why your pellets all swinging on a thirsty bitch? Rigor more tiss when I'm. This part is annoying, so I'm trying to find the perfect part. However, once I put it into my ponytail, it's going to be very tedious. I did this three different ways. The first way is putting the swoop into the ponytail the second way is bobby pinning it to the back and then the third way is just pulling it down to the ear so do it however which way you want to do it this video is split up in like two three different days honestly do whatever works best for you girl and i only pray for shit that i want you could say i'm used to getting what i want and a couple things i made i gotta do with something for tying the nail had you for a summer then i broke you off So I put my scarf on so it can be nice and flat so it can set nice how I want it and then I'm going to begin bumping the ends and another easier way to put it is kind of like doing a J above your head with the flat iron so you're kind of just flat ironing it and then swooping it to the front you're swooping it forward or you could do it downwards and then just do a J that way same exact thing Every day. So 
So I use a big old fat ass flexi rod to set that little bump. Um, but you could do a pink curl, but I am I slept overnight in this and pink curls tend to make my hair flat sometimes. So that flexi rod definitely helped keep my hair bumped and I don't got to do it the next day. I'm just trying to make a name for the village. Get the guap.